Hello everybody, I am Tom and you will watch me play Hogwarts something or other, what's it called? Hogwarts Legacy, I believe. Um, so, we've started the game, I've gone through all of the options, and now it's just throwing us into the game by the look of it. And we're starting with a letter. Hogwarts School of Witchcraft from Wizardry. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft from Wizardry as a fifth year student. Terms begins in the 1st of sem September. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, the decree of the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside of school. However, due to your unique circumstances, the Ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor Elisar Fig to help you hone your spellcrafting casting, rather, before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of term feast in the sorting ceremony. Yours sincerely, M. Weasley. Professor Weasley. Interesting. Deputy Headmistress. Um, I've done a pretty good job of avoiding all spoilers for this, which is impressive. Um, a few things I do know is that it's during the Goblin Rebellion in the early 1800s or mid-1800s, something like that. It's well before uh, Harry Potter happens. Character creator. Alright, I am going to spend some time doing this and we'll come back and I will be with you again. Alright, we're back. So, we're playing as Tom Hawthorne. Tom is my actual first name. Hawthorne is a name I randomly generated. Uh, but, <laughs> we're playing as a wizard. This is what we look like. Um, the voices here, you can change the pitch of your voice, but it sounds kind of interesting. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. You can tell it's pitched down. There's something... Artificial and tinny about it? something. So I guess we're going with the regular voice. But this is what we look like. Pretty cool. Let's start our journey, shall we? Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the term begins. Oh! <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatre goers in the West End. <laughs> it's a fantastic <laughs> laugh. <laughs> when I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Hmm? Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Well, now I think it's a bad guy with that face. Ancestral carriage, I guess? God, the music. <laughs> music is so good. Traveling companion. A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. 
Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ Ranrock, as to how huh? great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Interesting. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We did. Holy shit! Hang on. Oh, that's fucking cool. <laughs> Almost magic. So, for the non Harry Potter nerds, the things pulling the carriage, you Are can you only right? see them when you saw someone die. And you we saw hurt. the dude die. Perhaps a bit. Hence, they became visible. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... It had a collar. Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Wow, that's fucking beautiful, Jesus. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage travelled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think... The port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. 
interesting. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. And he knew we were in the Scot Scottish Highlands. I mean, I guess. Mind your step. It does kind of look like the Scottish Highlands, I suppose. With the gulls and the. And the Where island surrounding like that. The but. Key that brought us here. A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Interesting. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, there's the path down below. This way. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Interesting. Speaking of... Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Uh, tap right trigger to perform a basic cast. Interesting. Excellent! Use your camera to select an active target. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same thumbstick by disabling camera relative targeting. Okay. Wait, what? Select targets and move the... Interesting. Why would you ever want to do that? That seems horrible, but okay. <laughs> this guy seems too old to be doing the things he's doing. I mean, he's a wizard, I guess, but... That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. What is this? Blood pots. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Blob pots, therefore I will. Now. It's yeah, just it's ahead. Just, I need to check this way, though. There could be secrets. And if there are secrets... Ha ha! Say secrets. Uh, I, I'm not sure it gave me any... Oh, it gave me 46 gold. What the hell is gold called in Harry Potter? Galleons? Did I pull that out of my ass? I think it's galleons for the big ones. There's gold, silver, and copper, essentially, but I can't remember what the other two are called. I know gold is... One of them's galleons. I think it's gold. What a place. Steady yourself! Reparo! This is so cool. I love it. Why would someone have built this 
us here. I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Like this big mural and this big statue. The minimum of choice surroundings with the arrow in the middle, this gold thing is your current objective. Oh, sorry, with you, the arrow in the middle. Okay. Uh, press and hold up to toggle quest objective details. Cool. Professor Fig and I have travelled via Port Key to a remote cliffside in the Scottish Highlands. We need to explore the mysterious ruins that we suspect the Port Key was meant to lead us to. Professor, this statue... This may have been his home! Probably. <laughs> oh, that was cool. I was behind the back job. Some kind. Mm. Perhaps our host was a astrology. Interesting. Looks like astrology, right? It's astronomy over here, and then this side he's got something akin to tarot cards or something. No, that's alchemy, right? They're alchemical symbols. I think that one in the middle is a symbol for sulfur. I don't know the rest. Well, the symbol for sulfur and or hell, I think. Interesting. Alchemy and astronomy. All pushed together. Yeah, I can roll. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? This seems Professor dangerous. Fick. Whoa. someone have conjured that enchanted stone here and how is there a room behind it what room I don't see anything there's that glow again like the glow on the port key container all oh, right just investigate it name is that room going to be behind Godric's us now heart. yep where are we i don't believe it i hear someone snoring <laughs> we in gringotts hello it's a goblin banker right yeah and goblin banker <clears throat> snoring A moment. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> uh, we're <having> here. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliantly incredulous. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number twelve, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key. Hmm. 
Your wife's portkey. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Interesting. Stay close. After you. This is cool. Uh, keep your hands inside the cart if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> How many volts are there in green cards? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. That is so unnecessary, yet so cool. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in Damn. the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. That's actually kind of surprising. Surely one of the first... Surely you would build further down the longer you were running the bank, right? Vault number... Vault 12! Momentous day! <laughs> hmm. On your way. He's a grumpy goblin. saw on the porky container no darker i saw that same glow on the dragon's collar yeah what was that we were just wondering about that goblin back there he watches over the oldest section of the bank rare anyone goes there anymore interesting this thrush you right into the middle of like a conspiracy it's great <laughs> When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12. Until today. Well, that's intriguing. Vault 12. Thank you for your help. I'm weird about the back wall. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Oh! Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Hmm. Do I hold it? I guess I hold it. Oh, no, I move it.
Cool. That's a cool little mini game to learn the uh Revelio. Learn the spell. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. It's a chest if out what there. you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. I missed a chest. I'm so annoyed about it. Lumos. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Lumos! What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. It's a cool mini game to learn the spells. I like it. You don't have to do it. You can just kind of like see it, right? Um. So right trigger and tap Y. Okay. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. This seems dangerous. Look out! Protego! Accio! Defendo! Levioso! Deposo! Wow, it fucked him up. Oh, right, Defecto. I was supposed to be protecting. Confringo. Exposo. Exposo. Deposo. Confringo. Stay close. Professor, Professor Fig, Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Revelio. Ah ha ha! Lumos. 
Worth. Revelio. Lumos. It's a nice touch so when you cast Revelio, it turns off the light, because obviously. Revelio. Lumos. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. More chests. Protego. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. It's cool. I like the feel of this game already. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. Feels fun. Hold while during Protego to stun enemies with a stupefy counterattack. Interesting. So like a, a parry almost? Protego, stupefy. 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 This combat feels amazing. I'm like watching it when I first saw like the trailers and stuff. Lumos. I was like, Revelio. whatever. But now. Lumos. I love it. I love it so much. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Interesting. Revelio. Nothing more to see, apparently. Lumos. Well, wow. Revelio. Certainly intriguing. There's chests, so I want them. Yoink. Interesting. Is it a potion? did you? What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. Oh. That is a pensive. So it's a memory. For viewing memories. Interesting. I wonder. This is an intricate way to hide a memory.
man's decorating. Multiple men are decorating. Interesting. All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. Look I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have it. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Powerful magic. Interesting. Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Are we in the the dark forest? Yeah, 
Yes, it would seem. This is sweet. This is so sweet. That was a hell of an intro. 